Hey guys, welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you are new. My name is Nastasia and today we are talking about the topic of modesty in the church um, and modesty as a Christian. And before I do, if you end up liking this video, please give it a big thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel so you never miss out on a video every time I post. Okay, so the first thing I want to address with modesty is I think it is more important for you to worry about yourself than to worry about other people. What I mean by that is you should not be wondering, oh my goodness, how could they wear something like this? Oh my goodness, blah, 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 blah. Just worry about yourself. That is between them and God. Um, you know, if, if somebody, and that's the same thing for church. I get so annoyed when some people look down on other people for how they dress at church. So if they wear jeans, then everybody who dresses up more is like, oh my gosh, they're wearing jeans. Or somebody who dresses like a little more, I don't know, covered up will see a girl wearing a shorter dress and be like, oh my gosh, how could she enter the house of the Lord like that? And it's like, come on, like, let's just worry about ourselves because you are not God. Um, that doesn't mean you don't use discernment in what you believe, but it's really not your place to say who can and cannot enter the church. You don't know what's going on in their life. The best thing you could do is introduce yourself and show them some love. So that maybe if they are dressing a little inappropriately, they can look at you and take an example from you. And I wanted to also say that um, I actually learned about this concept in school. Um, I went to a Christian college and in one of my biblical worldview classes, we talked about kind of like the gray areas of the Bible and kind of like a weaker brother, stronger brother thing. Um, and I will try to post a couple verses on the screen so that you can look them up and kind of know what I'm talking about. But the idea is that what is a sin for somebody might not be a sin for somebody else. Um, that doesn't include like murder <laughs> um, or like, I don't know, stuff like that. But what is considered a sin for somebody, somebody else in their heart might be totally okay with it. So for instance, there are some um, women who they believe only showing their ankles is appropriate, that they would like to, you know, they can show their face, their hair, their wrists, and their ankles, but that's it. Everything else needs to be covered up. Um, and if they wore more revealing things than that, then they would feel like they were disobeying the Lord. Um, it's all about the heart, and their conscience would say, no, this isn't you. This isn't how you feel comfortable um, showing yourself in front of others and in front of Jesus. And then there are some girls who they'll wear shorts or a tank top or um, whatever, and they feel okay. They feel like they are respecting the Lord. They feel like they are covering up the areas that need to be covered up. And in their heart, they truly don't believe that they are sinning. And when I say truly believe, I don't mean like you wear something really revealing and you think, oh, I don't feel bad, but inside you really do and you really do know it's wrong. I'm saying like, if you really feel like I'm okay with this, I believe Jesus is okay with this. I believe I'm covering up what I need to cover up um, to still be honoring to him. If you truly believe that, then I don't believe that that is a sin for you. So this is a really tricky topic. Um, so please give me some grace in this because I could be wrong and I'm okay with being wrong. Um, but this is just what I believe and what I have studied in the Bible enough. Um, I do believe there are hard lines. I do not believe that you know, being naked in front of people is of the Lord. Um, I do not believe that trying to maybe impress a guy with your body parts, with like, um, like showing too much cleavage or showing too much booty or something like that and you know what you're doing and you're trying to get their attention in kind of a sinful way, I do not believe that's okay. Um, but I also don't believe that everybody has to only reveal their ankles to be considered a child of God and to be considered um, loved by him and for him to be okay with that. I think there are different levels. I really do. I think it's just, if it will cause you to stumble, then it's a sin for you. So like for me personally, I don't always feel comfortable wearing a bikini in front of some of my guy friends. Um, not because they're hound dogs or because they're disrespectful. Um, they are respectful to me. But I don't want to give them any kind of excuse to fall into sin, 
to stumble and I don't want to give myself the opportunity to fall into sin and to stumble thinking like oh I wonder who's looking at me or blah 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 or making my body more important to me than what God says um, but I'm okay wearing a bikini around like my girlfriends and around like strangers I don't really care about <laughs> or like on the beach or something but like when it comes to just being around my guy friends or um, I just try to be respectful in that way and that's just me maybe you're somebody who doesn't have that issue and you're like I don't care I'll wear a bikini anywhere or maybe you're somebody who's like I will only wear a one piece I think that's okay I think it's okay um, so I want to establish that really quick the idea that there is that if it will cause you to stumble or if you know it will probably cause somebody else to stumble don't do it um, you can't be aware of everybody's feelings and emotions I'm not saying just dress for the world but if it's something obvious then just be careful for me personally I'll just go over then what my personal modesty kind of is and this could be different for you and that's okay you are no less loved by Jesus Christ <laughs> if your modesty thing is different than mine um, so I told you about the bikini thing um, I don't like to be revealing on my chest so I don't really I don't wear like low cut V things or anything like that I am okay with things being off the shoulder I think that's okay um, I'm okay with short ish dresses so like um, I'm okay with it hitting like mid thigh as long as it's covering the things it needs to cover and I just try to be aware of if I if I can't bend over at all, if I can't do, figure out how to bend over without showing everything, then maybe I should reconsider. I don't personally like to wear super, super tight like dresses, um, like a very like bodycon things where it hugs literally every part of me. I don't think they're wrong. I just, maybe it's just I don't like how they look at my body. <laughs> I don't, I don't know. Um, but this is just for me what I feel comfortable in. Um, I don't care about, I can wear like t-shirts and I wear like, tank tops, um, I'll wear strapless bikinis sometimes, I'll wear strapless dresses, um, I try the best I can to not let any undergarments show through my clothing, mostly because it's not cute. I wear like a cami or a tank top underneath, um, or just switch things around so that I'm not wearing something see-through. And I think it comes down to what do you want to display? Do you want to do you want to show people your image or do you want people to see the image of God through you? Um, if you truly feel like you wearing a dress um, and some heels or something and walking into church is appropriate for you, then you should do it. If you feel like you are honoring God in what you're wearing, then you should do it. If you feel inappropriate doing that, then you shouldn't do it because you should not choose something that you very bluntly in your mind know is not okay for you your heart it's all about who you're honoring if you're honoring yourself or the Lord and if you are trying to get the wrong kind of attention or not there's a lot of controversy too that women feel like well I shouldn't have to cover up because I shouldn't have to worry about if a man sees me a certain way or not um, and then on the other hand people are like I have to cover everything up because I can't even give the the chance that anybody would see me sexually or something like that Here's what I have to say. You're gonna have it no matter what. Even if you dress completely to the nines, full of clothing, you have not an inch of skin showing, there's still gonna be somebody that sees you in the wrong light. Um, that's how it's gonna happen because people have struggles, sin is real, and life is hard. And then there are going to be some people who you could wear bikinis in front of guys and they don't see you like that. At the end of the day, when I have to think about it and make a decision about if I should wear something or not, I just try to have grace um, for myself and also for other people. I try to have grace with, okay, is this obviously revealing that it would be hard for somebody not to stumble into sin and sinful thoughts? Or I also try to think, okay, do I feel comfortable with this? If I do, am I living for other people just to try to protect them from any thought they could ever have? I think there's a happy middle. Um, be comfortable, but also have grace. And even if sometimes it's not fair to 
help other people with not falling into sin, it is of the Lord. It is of the Lord to help. Um, it is of the Lord to be gracious. And um, again, that doesn't mean you have to dress a specific way. I don't think there's a certain criteria. It's all about the heart. Sorry if that's really vague, but it really is all about the heart. But I'm here. That's that's kind of my view on modesty. How I dress personally. I'm usually, honestly, I usually don't have an issue with modesty because I wear a lot of really oversized, comfortable things. I wear a lot of sweaters. I wear a lot of leggings. Oh, that's another thing. Some people don't think leggings are appropriate. I do. <laughs> I'm perfectly okay with leggings for myself. Um, but yeah, I wear a lot of sweatshirts. I wear a lot of sweaters. Um, because I like to be comfortable. So anyway, that's my view on it all. If you have any comments, please leave them down below. Again, if you don't believe the same things, that's a-okay. This is just my opinion. Um, and I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I'll see you again next time. I love you. Bye.